Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Rohit Tech. Today in this video I am going to show you how to create mandatory profile in Windows 11. First of all we will create a share folder. Open this PC. Double click on C drive. Create a new folder. Our folder name is profile. Right click on profiles folder and select properties. Click on sharing tab. Click share. Type everyone. Click on add. Choose read and write access on this folder. Click share. This is shared folder network address. Click done. Now our profile folder is shared. Close C drive. Close profiles properties. Now we will create a new user. Right click on this PC and select manage. Expand local users and groups. Right click on users and select new user. Fill user information. Fill username. Example Vinayak. Fill password. Fill confirm password. Set the rights as per your organizations, in my case I will choose, user cannot change password and password never expires. Click create. Click close. See, our Vinayak user is created. Right click on Vinayak user and select properties. Click on Profile tab. Double backslash computer name. Slash share folder name. Slash username. I am connecting the user profile as well as the home folder. Copy the profile path. Click on connect choose any drive letter and paste the path. Click on Apply. Click OK. Close Computer Management. Sign out Admin User. Log on as Vinayak User. Fill Vinayak User Password, then press Enter. It will take some time because some inbuilt app install in background. Choose privacy settings for your device. Click next. Click accept. Now I am settings up Vinayak user, like set desktop icons. Right click on desktop and select personalize. Click on Themes, click Desktop Icon Settings, click on Computer, click Users Profiles, click OK. Close Settings. Right click on Desktop, select View and select Auto Arrange. Now I am going to create new shortcut on Desktop for testing purpose. Right click on Desktop, select New and click Shortcut. Type double backslash and computer name. Click Next, click Finish. Right click on Shortcut and select Properties. Click on Change Icon. I am changing the icon because my shortcut icon and this PC icon is same. Select Icon and click OK. Click Apply. Click OK. Sign out as Vinayak user. Log on as admin user. Open this PC. Double click on C drive. Double click on profiles folder. 
we are seeing two folders here. One is the home folder of the Vinayak user and the other is Vinayak.version6. Version 6 the folder contains all the settings of the user. Open Vinayak.version6 folder. See, it will showing you don't currently have permission to access this folder. Click cancel. Right click on Vinayak.version6 folder and select properties. Click security tab. Click advanced. Click change. Type admin. Click on check name. Click OK. Select, replace owner on sub container and object. Click apply. Click yes. Click OK. Click OK. Click advanced. Click change permission. Click on add. Click select a principal. Type admin. Click on check name. Click OK. Click full control. Click OK. Click replace all child object permission entries with inheritable permission entries from this object. Click apply. Click yes. Click OK. Click OK. In this whole process we have given the ownership of Vinayak.version6 folder to the admin. Now admin will be able to open this folder. Double click on Vinayak.version6 folder. Click on view. Click hidden items. By default ntuser.dat file is hidden. When we clicked on hidden items, this file started showing us. Right click on ntuser.dat and select rename. Rename the ntuser.dat file to ntuser.man. Click yes. As you can see the file name is changed. Uncheck hidden items. Let's go back to profiles folder. Now we have renamed ntuser.dat. Now we will again give the ownership of vinayak.version6 folder from admin to vinayak user. Right click on vinayak.version6 folder and select properties. Click security tab. Click advanced. Click change. Type vinayak. Click check name. Click OK. Click replace all child object permission entries with inheritable permission entries from this object. Click apply. Click OK. Click on add. Click select a principal. Type Vinayak. Click check name. Click OK. Click full control. Click OK. See, ownership has been changed. Click replace all child object permission entries with inheritable permission entries from this object. Click apply. Click yes. Click OK. Click OK. Now the process is completed. Close profiles folder. Sign out admin user. Log on as Vinayak user. Fill Vinayak user password, then press enter. Right click on this PC and select properties. Click on advanced system settings. Type admin password. Click settings under user profile. Let's drop down little bit. As you can see, our Vinayak user profile, it is showing mandatory. Click OK. Click OK. Close settings. Now I am going to delete this shortcut on Vinayak desktop. This shortcut is not even in the recycle bin after it is deleted. Sign out as Vinayak user. Sign in again as Vinayak user. As you see the shortcut is back. 
This means the user cannot change the desktop related settings in the mandatory profile and user cannot store any data on the desktop. Even if the user saves any data on the desktop, it will be temporary, as soon as user signs out, the same desktop setting will be set as the administrator had set. Thanks for watching this video. Please like share and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for latest updates.